Hello, it's Angie from Trips with Angie. I'm a certified sandals specialist and I can book your next sandals vacation for exactly the same price as booking direct through sandals. Plus you get all my help sorting through the different resorts and room categories. Today we are headed to Sandals Barbados and Royal Barbados, both adults only all inclusives. If you're entering Sandals Barbados, you'll pass right by Kimono's, the Asian restaurant, which also has soy, a sushi bar. Sandals Barbados and Royal Barbados are fully exchangeable, so you'll really only know which resort you're staying at depending on what kind of room category you book. Here at the lobby for Sandals Barbados, you'll find the gift shop as well as the lobby bar. Sandals Royal Barbados has a slightly different lobby. So that would be the only way you'll know if you're in Sandals Barbados versus Royal Barbados. Now out front from the entrance, you're going to see some of the restaurants. This is the Courtyard Bar. Behind it, you'll find Bombay, the Indian restaurant, and next to it is Kimonos and Soy. And then on the other side is Butch's Chop House, a steakhouse. And then there's a peek at the Merrymaker English Pub. Reminder, this is just a sneak peek video, so I'm going to just give you a brief overview to the two resorts. Here's Club Sandals Lounge. When you book a club level room, you get access to additional amenities. One of them is this lounge and the concierge service. Here's Cafe de Perry, the coffee shop. Behind that are the Crystal Lagoon rooms. This is the quiet pool. And right across there is Portofino, which is the Italian restaurant. We come through the building to Spices Restaurant, Buffet, Breakfast and Lunch, a la carte dinner. Also in this area is the Calypso Bar and the Calypso Lounge. This is the main pool with the swim up bar and the pool volleyball. Next to that you'll find Mariner's Seaside Bar and Grill and Dino's Pizzeria. I do love that sandals pizza. You order off a menu, they'll bring it to you here at the great picnic tables. There's the water sports you can see there in the background. And then this area is really popular at night. Your beachfront, you have the breeze from the ocean as well as those great fire pits. As you can see, the beach is beautiful, long wide beach um, with great chairs, natural shade from the palm trees. And then as you know, at Sandals, so many activities are included. You have your non-motorized sports. You have your motorized sports. If you want to go scuba diving, that's included. That's a peek at the beachfront building. So that's the only beachfront building on the entire property. So those rooms go quickly if you want that unencumbered beachfront view. You could see in the distance, they've put out a jetty, so rocks to help break it. Now we are on the Sandals Royal Barbados side. So we crossed over at that beachfront building. You can see the infinity edge pool that you can see through. This is Neptune's Seafood Restaurant. So you're nice and oceanfront when you're eating that delicious seafood. Here are some of the swim-up suites available on the Sandals Royal Barbados side. So you just hop right into the great pool from your patio. And here's a peek at some of the other rooms. On top of this building is an incredible rooftop bar and restaurant. Sky Rooftop Bar and Le Parisienne French Restaurant. So now we are just outside Lover's Lane Bar and Bowling Alley. So this is a hot spot at night, but you can access it during the day as well. Look at the great piano. You can see people gathering around there. But here's the shocker. There is a four lane bowling alley. That's right. It's included. And in front of it is a craft beer bar. And then outside you have your ping pong tables, your pool tables. So Sandals really is innovating with Sandals Royal Barbados by having these activities, by having bowling. I love that you have something inside active you could do. There's also the great Dirk Shack bringing some of their Jamaican legacy here to Barbados. And then this is the Sandals Royal Barbados lobby. So if you booked a Sandals Royal Barbados room, this is the lobby you would come to when you you checked in. So it looks a little bit different than the one on Sandals Barbados. Now we're in the Rondeval section of Sandals Royal Barbados. Take a peek inside. You have your king size bed, your table and chairs, your sofa, and your TV, as well as your little kitchenette. Your butler will take care of all your needs though. And the bathroom, you have the two sinks, the tub under the skylight, and the shower. These units are totally self-contained. So if you really want that privacy, if you're the couple that is looking for private alone time, you don't want to see another person, you could order room service for all your meals. This would be the room category for you because you have this beautiful backyard. You have the two chaises, your own table and chairs, another soaking tub, as well as your own 
own little plunge pool. And I think it's so funny that they made it so you could jump right into the plunge pool from your room. But don't worry, there's another door so you can step outside without getting wet. Here's the main plaza area where the evening live entertainment shows take place. Here's one of the two fitness centers. This is attached to the Red Lane Spa. There's another fitness center on the sandals Barbados side so you have the red lane spa with all types of treatments and then here's a new innovation for sandals they made a donut shop sweet and salty has all your favorite donuts and yes they even have those very popular maple bacon options thank you so much for watching i post new videos every tuesday i'd love for you to subscribe or you can sign up to get them sent to your inbox via the link with some special bonuses as i said i'd love to book your sandals vacation you can email me angie at tripswithangie.com